So day six of building our house, and the guys are just digging the footings, getting ready to put posts in. This baby carabao here keeps coming closer and closer to the dog, trying to make friends with her, I guess. So we'll see what transpires here. Let's see if they end up meeting each other. So the boys are hard at work making the the uh, posts for the house. These are going to be 16 by 16 inch posts. When they're done. It's a lot of rebar. We just ordered some more in. This guy over here is making squares to go around the posts and they're just twisting wire to wire them in get them attached and they'll go into the ground Put our first post in. It's exciting. So they put two inches of gravel in. There's water in the hole right now, but there's two inches of gravel in there. And then they've got the column in. So the next step, they're gonna mix some concrete, level it off, and uh, stick it in the ground for good. So we were just talking to one of the builders, and we're going to make it so that the ground, the, the floor of the house, is only going to be about two inches higher than what you see the ground right now um, and so that will allow me to not have a step on the front of the house I'll just build this area up a little higher to accommodate going into the house so that it's just a nice smooth level well not necessarily level but a nice smooth transition a gradual slope going in so that's a good thing so there's been a change of plans. What we're going to do now is put 16 inch posts down the center of the house and then they're making 12 inch posts for the perimeter of the house. That being that the 16 inch is the main roof support because it's down the middle so it's holding the whole structure of the roof. And these guys aren't holding as much weight so that's the way we're going to do it here. Post number two going on the ground. Just setting it up right now. It's 
a little wobbly at the moment. So I don't know if you can see that or not, but I need a tire really badly. The belts are all shifted on this one, and it is screwed. Oh, it's perfect. Still a couple good miles left on these tires. <laughs> Yeah, so the belts are slightly shifted on this one. Just a little bit. So an exciting ending to our day. We had to buy a new tire. Well, a new set of tires on the front. And uh, then we went to the gas station and bought fuel. And our fuel pump quit working. So I had to climb underneath and bang it to get it to work again. But we got it running again. But by the time all that was done, we didn't have any time left. And so that concludes day six. If you think I needed a new tire, please hit the like button. Don't forget to comment, subscribe, like, all those things. Push all those buttons for us. Really appreciate it. We'll see you tomorrow.